You want something? I'm, I'm Gabriel. I'm Dennis, nice to meet you. Look, I've got a job to do, so if you don't mind. I should get some help around this place. Begging for years. Did Mrs. Smith tell you I was coming? Who is Mrs. Smith? The lady who works with the volunteers. I, I told her that I was interested in working with the greeter ministry. Well, well, a real live volunteer. I've been desperate for help. Um, I I've never, <laughs> I've never volunteered before and I'm actually kind of new to this church, uh, but I love meeting people and, and I'd like to help out. I was wondering if you could show me the ropes. Sure, sure, it's pretty simple. You see the stack of bulletins? As people come walking through that door over there, everyone gets a bulletin. When the bulletins are gone, you're done. Gabriel? Dennis? <laughs> I'm so glad to meet you. Thank you so much for coming. I've been expecting you. I'm glad you came a few minutes early. I always like to go over a couple of things with the volunteers. I want you to feel comfortable with what we do. Well, I made this little card that highlights the four steps to being an excellent greeter. I use the acronym WARM to help us remember the four points. The W stands for welcome. Some people think that the main purpose of a greeter is to hand out bulletins, but that's not our primary purpose. The most important thing we do is give everyone a warm welcome, as though they were coming to visit us in our own home. But in this case, we're welcoming them in, into God's home. So smile and make eye contact. I like that. The A is for awareness. It's easy for us as greeters to get distracted. We start talking to friends and we forget what our primary purpose is and that is to be aware of the guests that are coming through the front door. Try to learn people's names and don't ever ask, hey, are you new here? It's better to say, I've never met you before. My name is Dennis. Good point. The R is for receptive. Your goal is to be receptive to the needs of the people who visit the church. It might mean spending a few moments talking with guests. You might need to guide someone to the restrooms. If they have children, offer to walk them down to the children's divisions. I like to introduce guests to other members or the pastor. And M is for mission? Mission. I tell my greeters that we are the frontline members who carry out the mission of the church. The pastor once told me the first impression that a guest have of our church often determine whether they will come back. So we should never forget that a friendly welcome might open the door to people accepting Jesus. I never thought of that. People will begin arriving soon, so let me go over two last things. First, here are some guidelines for the volunteers to dress appropriately and to look their best. And here's our sign-up schedule. I'd love for you to have us for a couple of weeks. Are you game? I'd love to. Do you have any questions? No. Then let's go over and give everyone a warm welcome. <laughs> 